Hi, this is Brad Linder with Little Hewding, and this is the Acer Chromebook Spin 13, which is a notebook with a 13.5 inch 3x2 aspect ratio display. It's 2256 by 1504. It's a touchscreen display, and uh, we're taking a look at sort of the early prototype version, which I've noticed is a little bit sort of funky in terms of uh, uh, some of the touch support. But the touchpad works pretty well, and this will be coming to market pretty soon. It's available as both a touch and a non touch version. This is the convertible style model, which means that it has a 360 degree hinge. You can fold the screen all the way back and use it in sort of tent mode, stand mode, tablet mode, and so forth. Uh, and that's because of the, uh, the hinge that we've got here. There's also a non-touch version, which has a hinge that goes back 180 degrees and stops. That version also doesn't have a touchscreen display and doesn't support a Wacom Active Pen, which you do get with the... Um, the Chromebook Spin version. Uh, both versions support up to uh, Intel 8th generation processor. This version is available with a Core i3 dual core 8th generation processor or a Core i5 quad core chip. The uh, non-touch version is available with Celeron Pentium and up to an i3 dual core uh, processor. Supports up to 16 gigs of RAM, up to 128 gigs of storage, and weighs about 1.6 kilograms or a little more than three and a half pounds. Acer says you should be able to get more than 10 hours of battery life. Uh, in terms of ports, we've got USB Type-C, Type-A, micro SD, headset jack, and on the other side we've got another um, USB Type-C, and uh, you can see that that's what's actually being used for charging right now, uh, power and volume buttons here. Um, overall, it's a pretty nice uh, solid feeling device. It's got uh, a decent design, it's got a backlit keyboard, it's got relatively large bezels around the screen, but it, uh, it's not something that I find particularly offensive on this model, particularly because it does have touch support. Uh, this model is being a little bit finicky though in terms of things like screen brightness adjustments at the moment. Uh, we're checking this out at Acer's 2018 launch event and not everything works perfectly. I, I was using a different model that uh, uh, didn't have any of the problems that I seem to be having getting this one to, uh, to react to keyboard controls. Uh, but anyway, so that's the Acer Chromebook Spin 13. It uh, goes along with the Acer Chromebook uh, 13, and there's also 15-inch models that have less powerful processors but bigger displays with more traditional 1080p, 16 uh, by 9 aspect ratio. So you can find more details about this and other new products from Acer being unveiled at their uh, May 23rd event in New York at lilliputing.com, or check out our YouTube channel for more details uh, and more videos from the event. Again, the Acer Chromebook Spin 13.